Oh, now to Oregon and crisis coverage this evening. Today we are hearing from Governor Tina Kotek and Oregon Housing Community Services about where their efforts to combat and prevent homelessness across the state stand. And KECI 9 News anchor Jennifer Singh joins us live in the studio tonight to break down what the governor's office says we can expect through the remainder of this year. Yeah, Matt, today Governor Kotek held a press conference in Salem where she announced the current and expected results of her homelessness initiative work. She says right now they are 80% of the way to their goal of rehousing 650 households experiencing homelessness and preventing nearly 12,000 households from becoming homeless. These results come nearly two years after declaring a state of emergency due to homelessness on her very first day in office. But now what's next? Today, Kotek also announced that through this biennium, January 2025, the governor's office is on track to maintain 2,400 or more existing shelter or navigation beds, build at least 1,700 new shelter beds, prevent a minimum of 24,000 households from becoming homeless, produce at least 2,800 affordable housing units, provide infrastructure for at least 25,000 or more affordable and market rate housing units. Kotek says there is still a lot of work to do, but it's important to let Oregonians know this work is still at the forefront of their minds and to recognize the work that has been done so far. Anytime government or my office puts out numbers and says, here's the progress we're making, I think it's important for people to see that because it shows what is possible when we set goals, we have plans in place, we make investments to reach those goals. Again, she says this is just a progress update on where they are serving Oregonians experiencing homelessness, and the work is still ongoing. And if you want to stay up to date on their specific progress, there's dashboards that you can see here. You can just follow to see just how state and local governments, along with community partners, are taking steps to reduce homelessness each day. And you can find them on the Emergency Homelessness Response website. That's orhomelessnessresponse.org. Live in the studio, Jennifer Singh, KEZI 9 News.